<laughs> He's going first. It's nerd day. <laughs> uh, t uh, but this is Mr. Campbell. Today we did. Uh, uh, I, I, I I can't place my finger on it. Today, oh yes, we uh, we reviewed the field trip. I have the students write in their Google documents about the uh, experiences that they had yesterday in the field trip. At five things, one, two, three, four, five things. Five things that they learned uh, about something new. Not what they did, but five things that they learned. Uh, it was really interesting because a lot of the kids learned a lot, and I. It was impressive. That's what I should say. It was very, very, very impressive. You should be impressed. It was super impressive. Uh, parents, you should be impressed. Your kids were amazing yesterday. Uh, also, we did uh, Dear Today, which is Drop Everything and Read. That's where we read our books for 20 minutes. And something I should very tell you that's uh, very important is, now I'll tell you, seriously, now i got to say this because it's very important. <laughs> As a yeah, positive. seriously. Uh, this is important. The students have two weeks to finish their medieval units. Yes, that's uh, two weeks. That's 14 days. That's 14 times calculated, 14 times 24. That's about 2,163 hours. Times that by 60. That's 127,524 minutes to read their novels. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I can't believe you did that without laughing. He's impressive. <laughs> All right, you want to go? Okay, sure. Um, <laughs> today in science, <laughs> I started, no, it's all good. That was awesome. <laughs> that was like, you should win an award for that. I, look, we're recording. Okay, Let's sorry. get it. It's enough about me. Sorry. Like, okay, um, today in science, we started an activity that they are doing in all of their classes. Um, it's a timeline project where in each class they will be discussing important people and events in their subject. So PE will talk about PE, I talked about science, English will talk about English, history will talk about history people. Here's one tomorrow. Tomorrow. <clears throat> tomorrow. Science started it today, so we just basically discussed different uh, people, the kids learned about what they did, what, they, what was important, um, and then they started the project. So they've got a packet, it's two pages, um, and they will be taking that with them to every single class, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Eventually, it will end up in his hands, um, and he will put it on your grade, or he'll have yes, it. Yes, he'll have it. I will have them. He'll have them. So, anyways, um, yeah. So that's what we did today in science. And oh, the only homework that I signed tonight is if they did not finish their vocab. Um, I know a lot of them did turn it in, but I know there's. Oh my gosh. Sorry. There's quite a few that didn't finish, so just check with your child, ask them if they finished their vocab. It's a paper with a bunch of boxes. Okay, Utah Studies, here we go. So we started a new unit today, and so they did a matching <coughs> activity as a group with their new vocabulary words. Then we wrote down their vocabulary words and explained what each of them meant and gave examples. And then we started learning, we're, uh, our new unit is American Indians. And so we started globally like, by looking at other tribes from other continents and other places in the world, um, narrowing it down to Utah. So that's about as far as we got today. So tomorrow we'll do the timeline and we'll finish that up and yeah, we'll start prehistoric tribes possibly, if we have time. Yeah, that's all. Said this yesterday, but uh, language arts homework is postponed until Thursday and Friday. It'll be due next Monday and then they'll get another one that Monday night. So. All right. Fabulous. Have a great evening. <laughs>